here we have a worm burner frame, hard up chopper worm burner frame. This is a customer's build from the ground up. So we've come with a Bandit 600 engine. This is a TL1000 front end, which looks quite neat, obviously with billet yokes. This is our forward control system that we supply and our noisy bastard pipes, which you'll hear on the video, so you'll know where the name comes from. Then as move, moving back, we come to electric box. So everything is in there, apart from the coils, which are underneath. But we've put a full re we've done a full rewire on this. So it's got Axel Jolst Electronics, which is a German firm we use. And they do all the switch gear, all the relays, everything that we need and a really nice little touch on this because nobody likes to see indicators are the tiny indicators here once again all part of Alex Jolst system which works really well uh, digital speedos airbag seat now this one's different in as much as the customer wanted to take a pillion which is very unusual on these bikes, but she doesn't weigh much, uh, which is just as well. She's not going to have much suspension, but there is a set of pegs, and we've put a sissy bar on just to take the extra weight for the rear wheel, for the for the seat for the passenger. This has also got standard 1200 Bandit rear wheel, so you can build this with one of our frames out of 600 Bandit and we've put flat track bars on this which which work really well with a bit of a harley sort of running running gear on that so i got our airbrush guru sammy from ss artworks and i asked her to do a ghost skull on this tank which he's done uh, which just sort of finished it off rather than just being black but you've seen earlier on in the video how clever it is so it's just a not I didn't want anything too in your face I wanted something nice and subtle so I think she's achieved that and who doesn't like a red skull on their bike <laughs> that's it I think it's probably time to uh, get out on the road and take her for a run don't you <laughs> 